because of you, our church sustains hope. I'm Gladys McLenahan. A little over two years ago, my husband Tom died after a difficult batter, battle with cancer. This was the most difficult part of my life. I needed hope. During those long days and nights during hospice and beyond, family members, church members, Pastor Kent, and retired Pastor Wayne Lura helped me deal with grief and my other feelings. Some cards, phone calls, and visits were more than welcomed. Many of my own prayers were my go-to for hope, for help, for guidance during this challenging time. Then in May of 2019, I moved to Eagle Crest South and shortly after sold my home on Main Street. It was at this time that the chairperson of our church's visitation committee asked if I would be visitor for our church members living at Eagle Crest South. I do believe that this was an answer to my prayers. I needed some way to help me heal, to share the gifts that God has given to me, and to become better acquainted with those in my new home. For the past year or so, I would visit these friends in person to share time and experiences with them and let them know that we cared about them. However, in the last seven months with the virus and the resulting quarantine, I resorted to phone calls, sending cards, emails, notes, flowers, and oh yes, sometimes sweets. This has been a very rewarding experience for me and has brought smiles and good feelings to the church members here at Eagle Crest. Our church maintains a very active visitation committee and during this pandemic period, we have tried to contact members by way of phone, cards, and notes with thoughts of staying connected. Our virtual worship has been a help but also had some problems with connection and hearing abilities. We all look forward to the time when we once again can worship in church, but in the meantime, we maintain hope and pray. Fred Rogers of Mr. Rogers Neighborhood was told by his mother to always look for the helpers. You'll know there is hope if there are helpers they can turn despair into action. We here at First Congregational Church are helpers. Because of you, our church sustains hope.